finally, that Let's Play of Kingsfield everyone's been waiting for. Yup, this is the Kingsfield opening. Oh, they can see the, the title on the video. It's fucking Metal Wolf time, Mike! The target, it's below. finally time for Metal Wolf Chaos! <laughs> You're fucking hype. Mike, I've been waiting to play this for goddamn years! I'm not even kidding, like five years ago I found out about this game. You have someone to thank. Again. Yes, I do. Sunbro Ryan bought the copy of Metal Wolf Chaos that we are playing right now, and it was not cheap. It was $200 because, holy shit, this game never came out in America. But it's the most American game ever. Look at that logo. Look at that it's America. got the presidential seal on it. Look at all that America. This was built for America. It was. Oh no, it's looping again. Uh -oh. we're, we're gonna get in there. Okay, you were get asking. We were asking for the first time ever. Neither of us have ever played this, but this well, this could be the best. This could very well be the best. It could very well beat the rest easily. Cellular modular. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> President Odular. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we're, we're gonna chill here for just a second while I explain the story behind this. Before we sat down to record this, you were asking me, why does Metal Wolf not exist in the US? Why did it never come out here? This is a Japanese OG Xbox exclusive, by the way, from FromSoft. Makers of many mech IPs like Chrome Hounds, also an Xbox exclusive. Murakumo, also an Xbox exclusive. Uh, and Armored Core, and I think another one that I'm missing. Frontline? I don't think, no, no, no. I don't think they're frontline. Um, oh no, okay. So let's go through this. You're asking why? Why did this not come out here? That's not, I, I went through work, uh, alchemy and, and, bubbling cauldrons <laughs> to make sure that you had and and arcane rituals to uh acquire an og xbox and rig it up to play this this japanese game they've put in that work. is regional i put in work um uh, but not all of this is translated there is a fan translation patch uh very generously provided by operation liberty <laughs> uh which covers like the important bases of the menu Oh shit! Here we go! We're in there. This never came out in the US, uh, because are you familiar with the name Vic Ireland? Or uh, rather his studio Gaijin Works? Or, yeah, um, I'm familiar with okay. Gaijin Works. So you know their whole deal is that they, uh, they were a publishing house that localized really niche, obscure Japanese games. Yeah. Stuff like Dragon Force. Yeah. Vic Ireland is the helm of that studio. Was. I think they shut down. He has been trying for years to get Metal Wolf brought over from Japan. And the reason that he cites that they won't publish Metal Wolf uh, in North America, despite the fact that the game is clearly, as you're hearing, voiced entirely in English. The, the entire voiceover is done in English. It's only subtitles that are in Japanese in this fucking game. Yeah. The reason that he cites is because, one, he thinks, uh, uh, FromSoft thinks that this game would be offensive to Americans, to a North American audience. Oh my god, here we go! Um, Let's just see how offensive it is to And us. because I've also read that there's some uh, legality issues with using the presidential seal, which this game uses very liberally, because in Metal Wolf Chaos, we play as the goddamn president in a mech suit called Metal Wolf! Let's party! Welcome They've This might be the best thing ever! They've localized so many games in the past where they've had to change little okay, things like like little uh, images all over the place. And if they use, as long as they, they could just edit out the seal, you're right. Even though it's on the logo of the game, like it is everywhere. But you could do that. I mean, how many people recently had to edit out the 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 Confederate flag out of oh, their game? Oh fuck off. Well, they did. A lot of people had to edit out the Confederate flag, and a lot of them, Be they the people not, who cared enough, they did not have to edit that out. If that you is want, nonsense. If, if you wanted to have your game on the uh, iOS, okay, store, yeah, that that no, you're right. That is stupid. There's a difference between like, no, it shouldn't hang in front of the the, uh, the state house of uh, of South Carolina, and revising history to like take the Dukes of Hazard off the air and shit. But well, we don't want to get too much into that. The point being that 
Yeah, they could have just edited it, it out. Yeah. I still can't say that word, by the way. Edited it. No, I, I, it, my mouth doesn't do that. Sorry to keep you waiting, Mr. President. So this is the hypest goddamn game ever. It becomes an underground base. So is this like in the future when? Uh, okay. Every, every you want to know how far in the future this is? You didn't catch it, but 21st they said they said that Michael Wilson here, descendant of Woodrow Wilson, is the 47th president. We're on 44 right now at the time of this recording. So this can happen. Yes, this is our future. This is a grim portend of our own future, is what I'm getting at. My, well, my last name's not Wilson, but my Wait, first... Wait, My last name's not Wilson, but my first name is Michael. Okay, so you're descended from Woodrow Wilson. No! That's what you're saying. What I'm saying is I should go and run for president and make okay, that Okay, so the whole deal with this... <laughs> you can, you can, you can that... be my vice. Yeah, we'll, and we'll I'll... battle I'll, it I'll, out. Yeah, in... Back. In mech suits. Okay, so the sub, the, uh, the there are no English subtitles for the cutscenes. We kind of fucked this up already. Uh, I'll work around that in editing so you guys hear. Okay, Jody. Um, we won't be talking over the cutscenes of the dialogue too much. I mean, you know, it's it's, it's what the fuck is happening? Everything is happening at once. So, there's this dope-ass boost button. Uh, this game actually, like... Where's your boost gauge? Oh, there it is, I see it. Okay, so... Check this out. The yellow bar is my boost gauge, but look. Look uh, as I overheat. It runs into my shield. Ah. Uh, and those those green pips at the top are my life. So, I can, I can damage myself by boosting too much. But you can boost until you're dead, essentially. I believe so, but I don't want to put that to the test. I can uh, air dodge and air boost around too, and I can fly. And I think I have one more attack, which is uh, that. I have a big ass air stomp. And FromSoft put a lot of effort into making sure that like, as much of the game is destructible as possible. So there are some really nifty systems going on in here. So uh, I was talking about Operation Liberty before subtitling uh some important stuff in the game like those those weapon pickups yeah they weren't subtitled they are that. yeah they are not in english uh by default uh you need that fan translation patch okay i don't know if you caught it but there was a bass line that hit for just a second for this song and it sound i swear uh this game's got a really good soundtrack I, that's the only thing i've spoiled myself on i was listening to it on youtube well i all i'm gonna oh, shut Aw. She probably didn't say anything too hype. I'll open the barrier now. Please okay. wait a moment. Okay, Jody, you do that. Anyway, the baseline in introducing this song made it sound like you were about to do Ooh, escape shit. from the city. Whoa, something quite dangerous. What like Sonic Escape? Yes. With missiles of that caliber. If you aim and fire, you should be able to easily shoot them down. What? Okay. Sure. Okay. So I think I could destroy just the scaffolding here. Yeah, yeah, that takes the whole thing. That takes all of them down. Uh, I should switch my weapon in a second. I have a I I have a handgun on the mech, and I have a shotgun. So check that shit out. Do you, you have... just cycle between all of them? So I think it's uh, left trigger for your left weapon and right trigger for your right weapon. Yeah. So I have an assault rifle that looks like a sniper rifle. Um. I believe I have a rocket launcher. Yes, yeah, I do. Right there. Yup. Okay, so what's set? So you oh my god, there this is, is a, so good. There is a special uh, system in this game, though, right? Where you can. You mean like a special attack? Yeah. I have no idea, to be honest. I don't. Uh, you're looking at that glowing blue gauge right now. Yeah. I don't know what that is. This game is mysterious. I spent like five minutes with the game just to make sure that I had the translation patch working. So I just worked out a couple of basic ass things. You missed ammo. Oh, where? Where was that? Right, right there. Oh, hey, nice. Heavy ammo up, nice. So does that apply so to all your So who am I missing? Weapons? Who am I missing? Guys over here? Guys anywhere? I mean, if you just destroy all the scaffolding, I'm sure. Oh, right there. Oh, there's hey, one there's guy. one dude, one lonely soldier. Waiting, Mr. President. The barrier has been opened. 
Thanks, Jody. Oh, I love Jody so much. Air Force One's launch preparations will be complete soon. Well, looky here. More guests. <laughs> well, I guess they won't be voting for you next term. She no, they won't. Minutes. They'll be dead. The She's in at Air Force One. Please She's fucking careful. on crack. Oh shit! They're gonna destroy Air Force One. <laughs> But you gotta call him in the center. Oh yeah, call him of dudes? Yeah. So I have to protect Air Force One from them. Let's- can I run them over? Yes I can! Of course. I like- I, I said this to you before, but I really like the scale of Metal Wolf, because it's not like, overly... It's not, the, like, the size of the mech, you mean? Yeah. Or the, yeah, yeah. It's not like a it's huge like mech. It's like twice the size of a person, uh, height-wise. It's literally like a boss in... It's a big exosuit. Yeah, it, it's what I would expect as a boss in, like, a Star Wars game, or, or actually, probably not. Like a Metal Metal Gear type of game, like a... Uh, no, Metal Gears are huge! No, 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 not the actual Metal Gear itself, but just, like... Like a guy riding a tank type of size. Oh, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Like the Mastiffs in yeah. Revengeance? Yeah. Okay, we cleared enough of uh, our non-voters. <laughs> so he can just get on fucking Air Force One! Just another day at the Oval Office. Huh, Mr. President? Welcome to Air Force One. I would hope that's not every day at the Oval Office. Yeah, it is. Didn't you see Obama's address last week? Oh my god, it's the reflecting pool. He came out of- That doesn't make any fucking sense! No. Nope. That doesn't even make a little bit of sense! Tell me the wings cannot clear that! The wings would definitely not clear the reflecting pool. No, it's not even close! Fuck <laughs> you, Lincoln! <laughs> Lincoln is so not amused by this! <laughs> Oh, we get to see the main oh, villain. Like they were ever invited. They're definitely off your Christmas card list. Michael! Up <laughs> <laughs> it! Richard! <laughs> I, don't th I think we got sidetracked. It looks like this party is just getting started. <laughs> That's the vice president. He started a coup, and now it's up to President Michael Wilson to stop the Vice President! You got an A in whatever those, so, those kanji mean. as you can tell, the voice acting in this game is bullshit, the story is bullshit, but it is great. It is everything I was hoping it would be. I am on cloud nine right now. Shortly after the President's escape, the White House was under the control of Vice President Richard Hawk, Pentagon, Congress, the VP is in control of all government. Oh, there's a typo. Agencies. Evil now exhausts America and rules over. America! Freedom is dead. <laughs> I'm gonna pass out before the day is over. What is true justice? This is the story of hope and glory. Peter McDonald. <laughs> Jody, update me as to the status of the nation. <laughs> the Pentagon... The and all oh, no. central government institutions have fallen into the hands of the vice president. Okay. How did that happen so fast? Have they? <laughs> have they? What Tell troubles me. you? Tell me. Did, did it, it trouble, trouble you, you to lose your presidency? Did it trouble you when I murdered your congress? <laughs> did it trouble you? They didn't say anything. Believe in your own justice. Yes! Better words yes! are never said. <laughs> Thank you! This is where that quote comes from if you've been wondering where we, why we've been saying that for like three years. I'm sure your father would have told you the same. Oh. Yeah! Our father would have told us to believe in our own justice, Jody! Dots. Jody, how's my schedule look for today? You've Tell done a conference and dinner party at the Japanese Embassy regarding wildlife protection. Are you offended by this, Mike? No. No. Yeah. Sorry, but I'll have to cancel that. No, I'm sure they'll understand America is in turmoil. <laughs> it needs its president. I'm heading out to save America. Can you let them know I won't be able to make it? 
Oh, shit. I have to- hold on. I have the biggest grin on my <sighs> face. Vocalize that. Oh, yeah. We need a fucking camera for this Let's Play, because I am just flailing in my seat. Hello, Americans. Good evening. This is an announcement from the Government Policy Promotion <laughs> Department, your American justice and freedom supporter. What? First of all, what I would like to tell each and every one of you is this. The president Recent hates Lincoln. We're not a mere coup d'etat, but rather a revolution to correct the wrongs <laughs> in the United States of America. To our oh my God! Our Sorry, my it's been water is in a crisis situation. <laughs> Since 2010, <laughs> domestic terrorism problems have increased rapidly. Economic disputes originating from the exhaustion of fossil fuels and the sudden rise in unemployment due to the influx of oh large-scale immigration. Neither the current president nor the American government took actions to address these various problems. On the contrary, <laughs> they have filled their own pockets adhering to terrorist cells. To correct this situation, Richard Hawk, Arizona oh my God. insurrection hero and vice president of the old government and Richard! the US military rose to the task at hand. Oh. Much okay. like our ancestors did, <laughs> based in a belief of winning freedom, and based in the belief of an independent war, and based in the belief in this great nation. However, to our regret, an evil to disobey this belief exists in the United States of America too. And here is that evil. This villainous terrorist, who first appeared in Washington and began his unjust rampage, goes by the alias Metal Wolf. His current whereabouts are unknown. While all of America will be under martial law until Metal Wolf is caught, please do not confuse the issues at hand. Without fail, the U.S. military elite forces, with a combined strength of 1.5 million, promise to smash this unforgivable evil to pieces. Oh my god, it's the flag in the background! This has been an announcement from the Government Policy Promotion Department, your special remedy for all kinds of evil. Oh, I still shit. want to point out that his name is Dick Hawk. So Richard Hawk! In, like, as soon as he initiates this coup, is in control of the media and can declare his martial law? You know what killed me in that cutscene? The words revolution with the flag masked into the text? <laughs> Photoshop is strong oh, it kills in this me. one.